T pain. So we are warning you guys now until Tunubu arrest one of you. You know, if you check Twitter now and just uh, type Tinubu's name or you type T pain, you will see different uh, different faces. You know, variants of uh, T pain. Not not Tinubu himself, but Tinubu face on variant on the like. Uh, Thanos from the uh, Marvel uh, franchise. Then you see the one from uh, Avatar as well. Then you see the one from uh, the Lion King. Then you see the ones from some evil regular guests as well. Then you, you see the one from evil portable. Variant of different faces of uh, Tunubu. So that is to say, if Tunubu did another planet for another universe somewhere, Tunubu will still be bringing pain. To those people over there as we speak. You understand? Because according to the Marvel franchise, the Marvel uh, universe, they believe we have variants of ourselves in other universes. Like we have so many universes, so many planets. So just imagine they have about a million universes. And we have that means we have variants of ourselves, millions in other planets somewhere that we do not know about. So whatever I'm doing here now, maybe the variant of myself, of myself is also doing similar stuff in another planet. So Tinubu variant, T-Pain, maybe certainly is bringing pain in other places. Well, please, eh, I want to warn you guys, you know, the state has already warned. We over, we've already discussed it before. Stop referring to our president as T-Pain. I am also still conveying the message to you guys. Stop referring to our president as T Pain. DSS go to enter the matter. SSS go to enter the matter. You have to be extremely careful. If you don't want, if you don't want to be the first person to be picked up and dealt with, <laughs> you know, in this country, they can just pick you up and just keep you for years without even court case proceedings. You know, they can just say they are doing investigation about you calling pre a president Tunubu T. Pain. 20 years, they never see finish the investigation of you calling President T. Pain. Well, you better be careful, guys. And uh, how is the economy so far? Eh? You know, I don't know why you guys are calling Tunubu T. Pain. Where World Bank recently praised Tunubu. They said Tunubu have to keep doing what he's doing, though. For the next 10 to 15 years, that's when Nigeria will really, really bounce back. Bounce back. So if you think, eh, see the matter go hand tomorrow, <laughs> rethink again. The World Banks are praising Tunubu. Eh? Uh, association outside Nigerians, Nigeria, associations, world associations outside Nigeria are praising Tunubu. The only people that are not present to Nubu are people that are in this situation. So I don't understand how, which factor then they read their own statistics there. Hmm? Which factor? How can I, how can I be in my house and see a house crashing? They say, okay, keep, let it crash like that. It's going to build more. Is The foundation will be strong now. I don't understand. I am not in that house. And people in that house are complaining that this house is crashing. You know? But me, I did outside the talk. The World Bank are supporting Tunubu. So I don't see how your talk is relevant. I don't see how your talk is relevant. You know, we that are in the situation, we want to feed now. Nigeria want to eat now. They want to eat now. Because now we eat, they leave, see tomorrow. Yes, that we want to eat now, but we are, they say we should be patient, we shouldn't eat well because of our children. And meanwhile, the politician will say, ah, all those steps are necessary. But then again, uh, they are driving the fancy cars, the security everywhere and everywhere that children are enjoying. So it is not fair now. It is not fair. At least a common Nigeria said, if I am hungry, all the politicians should be hungry. If I am crying, all the politicians should be crying. We should be in this together. That was make us nation. But, well, I don't know how you guys are going to go about it, but uh, the children of God will survive. 
the children of God will survive. Eh? And I, I am among the children of God. But be careful the way you call to the booty pain. You understand? Temporary pain. Temporary pain is kind of like good though, if that is what you mean by T pain. No? But there are other there are other uh, words for T as well. It can be tight pain, you know. So then let's talk about uh, this 25%. The federal government wants to introduce 25% tax cut from the rich. That's to say, if you are any above 100 million naira monthly, 100 million naira monthly, you they will tax they will tax your income by 25%. That should be say if you are any 100 million naira monthly, the government will take 25 million naira. So you will go home with 75 million naira. Let me fair read the statement before I go forward on that particular uh, introduction. I said the federal government plan 25% tax on Nigeria any above 100 million. Taiwo Oyedele, chairman of the Presidential Fiscal Policy and Tax Reform Committee, has said that a proposed tax bill could impose a 25% income tax on Nigeria any above 100 million naira or more per month. Speaking on the ongoing 30th uh, Nigeria Economy Summit in Abuja, Taibo also pointed out that 90% of current taxpayers shouldn't be taxed. Okay, 90% of current taxpayers shouldn't be taxed. Okay, the poor shouldn't be taxed. Before you say, hey, 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 hey. ask yourself, are you any anything close to 1 million naira? <laughs> okay, let me continue. Oyede emphasized that the need to strike a balance between easing the tax burden for the low income earners and ensuring the wealthy contribute more to the government revenue. According to him, he said if you earn 100 million a month, we are taking up to 25% from the rich people. That's because we need to balance the book. He said the government is prepared and determined to ensure that the right individual pay taxes, nothing that his committee is actively working to achieve, noting that his committee is actively working to achieve these goals. He added that the proposed change are expected, expected to take effect from January 2024 based on the passage of the bill by lawmakers. Who are the richest in this country? Politician. And who they pass the bill? Politician. You want me to pass the bills against themselves? <laughs> well, firstly, it is a nice bill for people who are rich. I won't see any why a poor man... When I check the comment section there, you know who are condemning the bill the most? People who haven't had 50,000 naira before. <laughs> Didn't you hear? They say 90% of Nigerians are not supposed to be taxed at all. That means you fall below those 90%. They say they don't want the tax now again. So maybe they tax the rich. But you that have never earned above 50,000 naira or slightly above, or let me see, they earn 200,000 naira or 500,000 naira. You are complaining for somebody who is any hundred million naira. Have you? I, I, I don't know. I, I, maybe I think they have not really sat down to read it very well. They say if you they earn above hundred million naira, they could they come out twenty five million naira per month. Twenty five percent. Twenty five percent of that money you are earning. Then, if person made the made the earn fifty thousand naira, they shout, ah, government don't come again, OTP. Ah, uh, didn't you hear? You are not among those brackets. You at least pray to be among. I pray to be among those brackets or people any hundred million. Then I can openly say, ah, the federal government is biased on this one because I am ending hundred million. It's affecting me. But it's not affecting you. In fact, they are telling you that they will stop taxing you. You should even be supporting the bill. But you you you, you not the discriminate bill. Are you any close to hundred billion naira 
that you are discriminating the bill. Then, in this country, I don't think taxation is the issue. It's, implement, yeah, it's yeah, implementing the tax. That's the issue. I am willing to pay my tax. I pay my tax. Eh? I pay my tax. But then again, who am I paying tax to? It seems like I'm paying tax to the government for the government to put into private pocket, uh, pockets by politicians. That is just the meaning of tax to Nigeria. If you are paying tax, the tax we are paying, we can see good rules, good education, no issue. The people will not, people will not be angry paying tax now. People will not be angry paying tax. But pay tax and then enter a few people pocket, take care of their children, go abroad. Then I become angry because you are using my money to take care of your personal needs. So tax is not merely the issue. Tax is not merely the issue. Hmm? So well, thank you guys for watching your boy the Adam's link. Catch you next time.